You've got yourself something funky. And now we've got ourselves something a little bit funky. And I didn't turn the light on, so if it's a little bit dark, oops, I can't reach down because I've got my phone plugged in. Anyway, what we're here for tonight, we are actually broadcasting over in the Chili Challenge group. Uh, so go and check those out. Chili Challenge group on Facebook. And it's basically a group by this guy here, Jimmy Bolton. It should have said Chili Challenge group across the bottom of there, but for some strange reason, it didn't. Evening, Jamie. Evening, mate. You're right. I'm probably better than what you're going to be in the next 20 to 30 minutes. Yeah. Now, obviously, you didn't want to be doing this on your own because it's your first time with the Tuba Terror. And we always have this guy here that jumps in with anything random. There he is. <laughs> Basically, if you mention that you've got a, a challenge uh, and you're going to do it, if he's got one, just message that guy up there because he'll always jump in with you if, he, if he's available. Um, that, that one, that one, yeah. that one, that one, that one. Right. Now, anybody that is unfamiliar with this challenge is the Tube of Terror. Uh, as you can see, boom, they're there. It's got Johnny Scoville's face on it, so that's telling you something right from the beginning, isn't it? Yep. Not going to be easy, because he's saying is, if it's worth doing, it's worth overdoing. Yeah. What are you thinking of it? Are you looking forward? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're talking about the after a bit, though, but... I have a empty one, so we know the rules, and the rules state, no food or drink. You have 10 minutes to eat the tube, uh, one or two peanuts at a time. After the 10 minutes, you must endure a five-minute afterburn, so it's basically a 15-minute challenge. You can eat them as quickly as you like, as long as it's two at a time. Give yourself a longer afterburn, but the full time is 15 minutes. Anybody in the UK wanting to get all of them, I do believe they're in stock right now down there. But before you go and buy, I suppose we should watch these two guys. I nearly did something naughty there, didn't I? <laughs> these two guys up there. <laughs> right then. I'm going to switch switches around for a second like that. Jamie, would you like to read your disclaimer? I, Jamie Bolton, am over 18 years of age, sang mind, and have read and understood the Hot Sauce product disclaimer on the League of Fire website. In summary, I accept the League of Fire, the suppliers and manufacturers will under no circumstances be reliable or liable for any claims of injury or damage arising from me consuming this product and what was error. I acknowledge and agree to this without question. I, Angus Geo Bates, my have 18 years of age, of sound mind, and have read and understood the project's claim on the League of Fire website, except that League of Fire, their suppliers and manufacturers, nor nuclear, will under no circumstances be responsible for or liable to any claims of injury or damage arising from me consuming this product and multiples thereof. I acknowledge and agree to this fact without question and take on the challenge of my own free will. Perfect. So, has any of you intend on smelling the tube before you uh, after before you start? Yeah, I knew it was going to be Jamie nodding straight away. No, I've done it in the past. I've done it on the think the second or the first one. Uh, no, I'm good. You know what just coming. So, no, you like to crack open your tubes. Once they're open, they must stay in camera and in full open view at all times. This is usually the point where we get some comments about how big Johnny's nuts are. Right. 
right. All nuts out of the tube and cleared. Yeah. This is fire on the way in and fire on the way out. Are yeah. you ready, guys? Yeah. Yeah. I'll give you a countdown, and at the end of the countdown, put your first nuts in your mouth, and we will start the timer. Three, two, one, go. Oh, baby, got me. Go on, Gus, dude. Kick their butts. Although there's no butts in this, it's Carolina Reavers. <clears throat> Jamie looks like he's eating a packet of KP. Go on, bud. Control your cough, Gus. Control it, bud. You've got plenty of time. You don't have to eat fast. Lee Alexander still has a tube sat there. He's intending on doing. Jamie, well focused there. No, I can't do it. Can't do it. Still got plenty of time. Oh, I thought I was I'm ready for it. I'm not. You're not. It shows you it's a serious challenge, this one. It is really hot. Well done, Gus, there, dude. Until you take a drink, or I uh, will leave you there anyway so you can cheer. You got this, bruv. Come on, baby, you can do it. <laughs> No, I can't. I think Jamie thinks the peanut M and M's. Funny that I had a pack. <laughs> How did you prep for a tube of terror? Three packets of peanut M and M's. Yeah, I'll pop you out there, Gus. See you in a bit. And we'll go full screen and hope we don't. There we go. Well done there, Gus. <laughs> the tube of terror is seriously hot, but seems to be unaffecting Jamie. Plenty of time there. Oh, there's the hiccup starting. That's pretty good, that, because you've got halfway through the tube and only just started to get the hiccups. Mm. Remember, you've still got plenty of time, so... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Stu says, you're nice plate, you're doing great, Jamie. I did not. Kaylee says, you haven't even broke a sweat. You've got the hiccups, but no sweat. Mm. Pete EHP Sullivan says, well done, Gus, mate. Jamie, you're bossing this. Stu Walker's loving your hiccups. Cheers, Stu. Seven nuts left. <clears throat> Colin Smith says these nuts are what definitely gave him the bug for the madness. Only halfway into your eating time. Well, not even halfway into your eating time and nearly finished the tube. There is points for just completing the tube regardless. Uh, and then there's points for getting it correct. 
he's on the last nut so we're going to bring up the banner just in case those in the uk want to get hold of them well anywhere in europe really other than that obviously you get them from blazingfoods.com And that's the last nut beaten. You beat those in a record time, I think, there. It was less than five minutes. What did you think of the heat? Start off with, fine. It's building up a little bit now. You've beaten the hiccups, I see. That's quite difficult to do that. Once the hiccups get a grip, some people can't. Battle them again. Well, I'm one of them. So, Stu Walker saying, "Now just breathe steady, brother." Heather Wright says, "Fantastic time." <laughs> Lee Alexander is watching this as he's covering his nuts. He's actually covering his nuts in marmite. But don't ask questions. <laughs> Just leave it to sound as weird as it sounds. James says the peak will come soon and then go back down again. Yes, Kaylee, it's his first tube of terror. I'm going to see if I can bring comments up without it making the uh, screen go funny. Yay, we can. Back to that. Do you think you could do multiples of them at this point? Um, maybe. Maybe. <laughs> You've learned how to answer questions when we ask them, haven't you? <laughs> Fast learner. <laughs> Good point there, Adele. Smash the hearts, guys. Now, th this challenge was the very first challenge that I accidentally made somebody burn. I think it was a minute and a half longer than they should have done. I can't remember who it was, though, so whoever it was, sorry, mate, but <coughs> we'll see if we can go for two minutes extra with Jeremy tonight. <laughs> James Nixon saying, where is your heat level round about now? Um, about five. About five. Leveling out. Where did it go to? About six, six and a half? Um, yeah, maybe. Maybe. That sounds more like a six then. <laughs> yeah. Adele, I won't ask ask that question because we don't want you focusing on that spot yet. So we'll leave that one out. <laughs> James Garrett says you're smashing it, mate. James Nixon has asked an interesting question. These are the Death Nut 3. Death Nut 3 a lot hotter. <clears throat> Death Nut 3 are a lot hotter. So there you go. We did have suspicions that there were. Yeah, David, uh, 
Kevin was at work. He couldn't couldn't he, he got an extra shift at work, and Gus got the coughs. Evening, let's check, dude. You're nearly into your burn time. They call it a burn time, but we'll call it a cool down time because you've been burning. Cool down time. Yeah. James didn't find his death nut three too bad, but he's had a couple of tubes of terror that were pretty brutal. <clears throat> I noticed you bought your missus a new bike today. Well done, dude. Yeah, the one I got her last Friday, she didn't uh, didn't like it, so sold that one on Thursday and then got her another one on Tuesday anyway. <sighs> She seemed very happy with the one that she's got. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's the upgrade from the one she had. Oh, nice one. Have you managed to get the kiddie basket for the back yet? Yeah, we've got a new bracket, so... <sighs> Anybody wonder what we're talking about? Some horrible little law life decided to steal the bike that she uses to take the young one to school. And they just took off with the lot. Yeah, they took it from outside her work. And that's it. She doesn't just use it to take the young to school. She used it to get the work to as well. And they literally just took it. You'd think the fact that it had a baby basket on the back, people would leave it alone, wouldn't you? Um, no, no. We had the seat. The seat was off, but the bracket was still on it. Oh, I thought the seat was still on it as well. Not that it makes it any better, but... <laughs> Hello, Hello. He's got his milk there at the ready. Hulk smash! <laughs> Adele collects those little, uh, little characters and things. She's got a shelf full of them. I haven't got Especially the Lego ones. It's the Lego ones, man. Oh, David saying, ride it out, Jamie. You got this. There's a good point there, Les Check. We did hear there was a uh, tube of Terra 2 coming, but it never turned up yet. Something tells me it might be made with the final chamber of the Death Knot 3. That's going to be some serious carnage. That's going to be pretty brutal, really. <laughs> He has two minutes there, easy there now. Geo says, smash it, Jamie. That's right, James. It was about March last year when we heard about the Tuba Terror 2. It could be coming soon. Terror wasn't last year, it was the year before. It was coronavirus last year. Oh, yeah, it was the year before, it's even longer. Coronavirus basically just destroyed an entire year of our lives. Most of us can't remember. Last minute now, <laughs> Jamie's thinking, Yay, milk, milky, milky, lovely. Right, it's like died down a bit now. Heather sat watching that in 24 degree heat. So, yep, she's in Spain, I'm guessing. 
Oh, lucky here. Yeah. I see a second tube of terror. That's not another full one, is it? Seeing nothing. Mm -hmm. No, it's only me. Yeah. Is that, a, is that a full one or an empty one? No, that's my the empty one. one. Yeah, not, Five, not a second one this time. Four, three, two, one, boom! The tube of terror, being yeah, in I, oblivion. I need to see how this one reacts with me later on before I even think of doing a second. Smart choice. I, I noticed you're uh, very well prepped when, when you were setting up behind. You got your milk ready, you know. You don't take many chances, do you? No. no. See, I like the challenges. Too. I like the challenges. They just didn't like me after. Well, congratulations. That's another one to tick off your legal fire list. Uh, which ones haven't you done yet? Um, the chocolate ones. Um, and the chugs. You've done um, none of the chocolate ones. No, I've got a, um, a CCN in the cupboard. Um, I should be doing that within the next couple of weeks with Colin and maybe Kevin. Have you or done the bites? Like, yeah. Um, I should be getting some bites again later on. So, so basically, I the, there's the Nemesis and the Raspberry Rain you haven't done. Yeah. Other than that, the oh, the legal fire. oh, you haven't done the Moab either? No, not yet. Fear of a half pound of chocolate by any chance? No, just haven't gone into getting any yet. Uh, I thought it might have been a volume thing with... No, no, no. Well, congratulations again, dude. I'm going to let you get out of here. Please do check out Thanks. the Chili Challenge group because that's where he does belong as well. <laughs> how, how many points are these? Seven. Oh, sorry. Oh, they're definitely worth the seven points. <laughs> it's not an easy seven pointer. <laughs> no. Well done, dude. Right. Thank you very much. See you, See you next week. That's Jamie Bolton of the Chili Challenge Group. Go and check them out. Facebook. Uh, type it in the top bar, cross the top of that. You'll find them. Join the group and we'll have some fun while, while you're there. I'm going to get myself out of here. This was Nuke Chili Eds. I was Lucifer's son. Come and join us too. Uh, Go into that turn fight search bar, put mutually ed, brrr, you'll find us, or check us out on Facebook or on YouTube and click the subscribe. Bye guys, I'm gonna get myself out of here.